All right, y'all. Back for more Dying Light 2. I'm actually not that uh, far away from where, where I uh, ended the last gameplay. Hang on. Let me go down here real quick. Did she leave? What the hell's going on? Sorry, uh, I know that I got really uh, side sidetracked there, but uh, I assume I need to kill those things at some point. Um, all right, I am gonna grab this quest right now. You know me? Yeah, I was hoping I'd bump into you. Actually, let me introduce myself. I'm Rahim. I run Sparker, the first post-apocalyptic dating service. What? A dating service? I could use a little something something if you know what I mean. Uh, tell me. Oh, I'll gladly explain. Get you up to speed? Okay, I'll admit it. I made you a card already. Whoa, <laughs> what? I created a profile for you. A uh, profile on, on a card? What on earth for? Well, it's my job. The world may have ended, and most of our loved ones have turned into bloodthirsty monsters roaming the streets, but uh, that doesn't mean people have stopped being lonely. I mean, shit, that's exactly why they're lonely these days. You mean to tell me there was a time when people weren't lonely? Imagine a world where people actually went out to work, shopping, walking their dog and on top of that they had dating apps um uh apps okay okay never mind what i'm trying to say is that before the shit hit the fan we used to socialize there were parties you know when people got together just for the sake of being together and of course to get laid <laughs> now Everyone just stays home, behind closed doors, because, well, meeting new people can result in getting clubbed in the skull for a bucket of water. So, well, let me get this straight. Your cards help people meet. Basically, yes. People who want to meet other people come see me. I draw them. I'm pretty good at that. Or at least, that's what I'm told. Then, I put their portrait on a card and display it on my dating board. If someone's interested, they get in touch with me and voila, a romance is born. Not always for very long, but uh, I guess that's something that hasn't changed. But right now, I'm in deep shit and I desperately need help. Of course you do. Some shithead trying to imitate me forged several Sparker cards. They scattered them around town. That's infringement. It's ruining my reputation and disorienting my customers. I need someone to collect these fake cards for me and bring them back. I heard that talentless hack was killed in a dark zone, so he won't be bothering me again. And I managed to find most of the fake cards. But there are two left I couldn't get hold of. Bring them to me, and I'll give you the card I've made for you. Check the map on the wall. 
I've marked possible locations for the fake cards. Uh, what do the cards look like? Is it these things? Man, I don't want to do all this. This is bullshit. Just tell me where to go. Seeing you. All right. Um, I thought I saw a quest. Yeah, there, there is a quest over. Dying in Carnage Hall. I want to be a champion anymore. Happy. Oh, what is happiness if not a disease of fools? Uh, you lost me on that one. Wait, you seem like a man of power. Do you wish to possess the world's most powerful weapon? The world's most powerful weapon? <laughs> okay, what is it? You will see with your own eyes. I will give you its location, and in return, you will give me all your money. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, what is money compared to such a priceless thing? It buys me food and drink, keeps me from starving. I can go on. Fine. Two hundred and a money-back guarantee. And if you do not value the weapon as I have, I shall return your money. Will you accept my challenge? Okay, I'm in. Look for chests hidden on the old overpass overlooking East Horseshoe and the roof of the office building close by. The last one you open will contain the world's most powerful weapon. Search and you shall find it. Shit, this won't be easy. Hasn't hosted a tournament like that in years. Um. Okay then. Alright. Get up there. Is, is there a bed in here that I can rest in? Because I. Oh yeah, there is. Okay, because I have a couple night quests I like need to do. Let's do this. No. Yeah, let's do this one because I'm like right here. I actually have a lot of side quests to do right now. I mean, we questing. We vibing. I still ain't found the gun. Good night, Aiden. Anything catching your eye? Good for you. Come back later. Uh, where's this quest at? Oh, it's over here. Running the streets at night? Damn. It's hard enough on the rooftops. Is there a reason I have a waypoint over here? Yeah. Didn't think so. All right. Oh, dear. What is that? Is this a zombie hovering in the air? Oh. Well, we won't know part of that.
Hello. Got him. All right, going in. No, I actually have a healthy amount of, uh, I was about to say, I have a healthy amount of resistance, but, uh, kind of harder to say that when, uh, you know, you like go to those areas. I swear I've been in this building before. You know, I like this stomp ability I got because now I can just like kick them on the ground and just stomp them to death. I, I don't even have to use my weapon sometimes. Who the fuck are you? Come closer and I'll kill you. Will and Monica sent me. Fucking Will. You better fucking run. I'd get out of here and he's dead me. Oh, wait, calm down. Fucking rip his guts out and tie him in a fucking bowl. Ah, uh, oh, actually, um, Monica's pregnant. Wait, what? With your kid. Wait, are you telling me that I, I'm gonna be? You're gonna be a father. Well, fuck me! That's fantastic! A goddamn miracle! Why'd you say so at the beginning? I would have, but you were a little, uh, worked up there at first. What if there's not only one? Maybe it's twins or triplets. What's your name? If it's a boy, I want to name him after you. Nah, I'll leave that to you. Now get out of here. Monica's waiting. And Will, he has an apology for you. Nah. No apology needed. He was kidding around. Yeah, like guys do. No harm, no foul. You leave him alone? You kidding me? Hurt my kids, Uncle? Now why would I go and do a thing like that? Uh, I better go propose to Monica. We don't get married. People will talk. People can be so cruel, you know? Well, he's sure like 180 real fast. Hey, let's go. What is happening outside? So I got another quest. Oh man, that's like really far. Are there any other like quests or anything out here? Oh wait, wait hold on. Actually, not not quests. Are there one of those? Um, well, there is a side quest right here. But no, I need to 
do one of these things so i think i'll grab this quest that's over here and then we'll go here That's the thing that sucks about coming out here at night are, are those big homies are like everywhere. Thanks. My name's Wash. Aiden. How noble of you, saving an enemy. But you're not my enemy. But now we're on, what's the phrase, opposite sides of the barricades? We're on the same side when the infected are involved. What are you doing here? I'm afraid that's top secret. So you're a spy. Should I warn the locals about you? All right, I'll tell you. It's a secret, just not a military secret. I was supposed to meet a girl here, from the bazaar. Don't see anyone here. Looks like she stood you up. This wasn't a date. We wanted to leave the city, get beyond the walls. Yeah, it's not that easy. We would find a way. Why do you want to leave? Chloe's had enough of there being shortages of everything at the bazaar, especially water. But the bazaar has water now. Chloe doesn't know that yet. She lives outside the bazaar. You just go to her and check. I will. And can I ask you a favor to save time? I'll go to Chloe's place. Can you go to her friend Liz's? Chloe's always over there. She lives at 25 Wuthering Mews, third floor, above the old vegetarian restaurant. It's near the clinic. I'll see what I can do. Thanks. Let me know over the radio when you get there. So I still got find the dress to do, but let's uh, try to head this way. God, get up there. What's my guy doing? Oh, that was one of those running ones. Lame. Alright, whatever. One. Hey, get up there. Oh, shit! I hit spacebar twice like a dumbass. the abomination it. Eh? 
Is it because I'm being chased? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, I think it's because I'm being chased right now. Huh. Let me try to undo this real quick. Oh, you bitch. I didn't know they could do that. Is there some reason I can't heal? Why can't I heal? What the hell is going on? It won't let me heal. This game's got some bugs, man. Like, I, I, I do like this game, but it, it it's got some fucking problems. And this game's been out for a while. I mean, this isn't like this just came out. Yeah, I can't heal. It refuses. God damn it, man. Oh my god. Well, I definitely haven't done this one because look, like it's it's all like not checked off. So is there some reason this refuses to work? I don't I don't know. All right, whatever. I guess we'll just head to the quest, I guess. So wait, I have done this one? I'm so confused. Okay, well then if that's true, If that's true and I've done this one, then like, why is it not checked off my map? That like, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get it, man. Unless there's like another container, like that one over there, maybe. What is happening with this game? It's like bugging out left and right. Ah! 
Yeah, stupid. Yeah, I still can't heal. I mean, am I doing something wrong? Yeah, I could just kill those fucking things. Like, it's not like it, they're they're impossible to kill. I've killed them plenty of times. Container around here somewhere. Ooh. Oh, I can heal. Well, thank God. Like, what changed? We don't know. Who, who the fuck knows? But I do know I can kill this thing. Does it mark? See, it, it marked that I did this one, but like this one up here, it just acts like I've never done it. I don't get it. I swear there was a gameplay. I, I couldn't tell you which gameplay it was, but I swear there's a gameplay where like that fucking thing, it like ran up a building and just like fucked off. And I'm like, uh, what? Let's do health.
All right, I just gotta get over there somehow. to find perfume now like way over there. Oh, come on, kids. Oh, God damn it. Is this a night mission too? Oh shit, I, I think the sun's about to come up. As long as I can get in and get out real quick, it'll be fine. the perfume. Go to this ombre. Huh? I really want to get that ability that lets you jump off zombies' heads. That that's gonna make traversing this shit way easier. 
But like, does this game have a grappling hook? The first game had a grappling hook, and by the time you got that, I mean, or when you got that, man, that, that game became really easy to like traverse the levels. I mean, like, hella easy. weights which you seem to not have Light up. Really? I mean, yeah. uh, oh is shame you never had time for me before i was busy real busy but inside i've always been fond of my horace um damn girl uh i'm sorry i need to have a word with my friend just don't keep me waiting. That's not Madeline, is it? I, I know what you're thinking, but it's not like that, Aiden. She's the one who came on to me. That bath, man. I think it gave me... It's the confidence, man. Women sense it. What about Madeline? I love her, you know, but... I mean, did you check out Ada? Never even come close to a beauty like that before. And she's great to talk to, uh, and we both like climbing, and she laughs at my jokes. I mean, not many do, mind you. She came up to me and just sort of latched on. Fuck. Fuck, who do I choose? Um... Why don't you stick to your guns, dude? Sometimes a bitter truth is better than a sweet-smelling lie. I mean, deep barely met that Ada, right? But the way you looked at that picture of Madeline and how you were still thinking of her after all this time, <laughs> it doesn't happen often. Yeah, you're right, I suppose. You're young, but I gather you've seen your share, being a pilgrim and all. So, what exactly are these DLC things? Ooh. Oh, they're bandit stuff. Oh, God. Ow. I still don't understand what makes that gas come out. Oh man, I got one lockpick left. Oh, it's the lucky lockpick, yes. What happened to this homie? I like kicked him over here and he just like burst into flames. Like, what? Okay, I, I am mildly interested to see what this quest is. I just want to know, like, how, how annoying is it going to be? What is this? Master Charles become a legend. Okay.
I'm here for the tryout. Yes, we're watching. Street level in the moonlight. Start whenever you're ready. But at night? The, and the infected? Part of the challenge. Gonna get to the finish line. Don't care how you do it. Okay, how much time do I get? Not much. Now go. A scout from Carnage Hall is watching. Shouldn't have slid. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. Um So okay, all the others just kinda of far away. Um, let's see here. The matchmaker. I met her in a dating service. Made a... But, like, is, is this one where, like... Well, well. You got quite the result. Talk to you at the next challenge. Anyway, what I was trying to say, and I... I knew you were natural. Well, thanks for the tip. Always a pleasure. Meet me for beer at the pumpkin farm on Fitzwilliam Place. Yes, I'm buying. I was kind of hoping I could sleep there to get rid of the daylight. Oh, God.
It's in this building right here. Right. Alright, so is the card like in a in a box? Is it on an enemy? Is it just laying around? Like where where is this thing? You know, I don't kill a lot of the normal zombies, but like I need their little uh what are they called trophies or whatever. But like I don't kill enough of them to really get a bunch. Back I usually just tend to ignore the fucking things if I can help them. that drop kick <laughs> it's i think it's my favorite thing in the whole game right now i think this is where my lock pick my trusty lock pick my last lock pick finally meets its 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 maker It's been a good lockpick. All right, if I was a card, where would I be? I'm just roaming around here like a fucking menace, man. I just love it. All right. Well, it's definitely in this building somewhere. But like, I think I've smacked down everything I can smack down.
Or have I? Definitely nothing in the oh here we go, here we go. A sparker card. I know exactly who's looking for this. Oh, how like walked by it earlier. Come on, Kinzo. Um How do I get to oh shit, I walked right by this too. Uh, bitch! Open uh. All right. Get the cluck out of here. Oops. I mean, I am just roaming around like I'm a fucking problem. Have a deal. You're always welcome here. Hmm. Wait, there's something on my. I have a waypoint set for some reason. It's just the greatest. Oh, it's in this old base thing. Okay. Sparker card. Hey. You know, this used to be a bell tower in the Middle Ages. I wonder what happened to the bell. I'm no PK fan, but whoever carved the skin out their commander was a certified psycho. Alright. I'm gonna make this daylight, man, because this shit's annoying. Oh my god. He thinks he's 
so funny. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. There's that windmill that I, I've never been able to do. This is my moment. This is my moment. <laughs> the scaling on my characters uh it's a bit much all right anyway um What should I do for combat points? Let's see. What were we thinking about earlier? What? I want that. I think. Pretty sure that's the one. Um, I can't get it because I ain't got perfect parry. Fine. Sorry, I know it took me like w way too long to make that decision, but I, I was fascinated by that like grab an enemy and run off the ledge thing. Where'd that windmill go? Oh, it's over here. I thought there was like another windmill around here that I haven't been able to do. I mean, I, I see this one, but ain't that the one just from that building? I thought there was like, no, I'm just dumb. In summary. Like I saw this windmill and it it they, they all kind of look similar-ish. So I saw it and I was like, oh yeah, that's that's the one I couldn't do. Oh, your fault. I also blame this on me. Hey, there's a quest over here. Never ending. Oh, it's you two. Hey, I'm that pilgrim. What's wrong? It was you? <laughs> Great. We got our ration today, but Maria here wants to use it all to wash her hair. Because I can't stand another fucking day like this. Just because you don't mind hair like a sheep overdue for shearing doesn't mean all I want is to water the plants, Maria. What good will your shiny hair be if you starve to death? It's 
gonna rain tonight. I'm sure of it. You'll use up the water, and then it'll rain. Those plants don't need that much water anyway. It's your way of showing me you don't care about my needs. I'm sure you can figure this out. Uh, look, maybe you could wash your hair and then reuse the water for crops. No way. Soapy water can harm them. And germs can harm me. I get it. I don't need to shower every week, but I need to maintain a basic level of hygiene. Um... She's right. Hygiene is a top priority, even in the darkest of times. Germs can kill you, you know. Germs? Seriously? Don't tell me you don't know about germs, Patricia. I guess we all need to keep an open mind and learn a bit more to make informed decisions, hmm? What's that supposed to mean? Look, it's raining. It means you're being irrational about this. Oh, yeah? What's rational about allowing our crops to wither and die? Okay, ladies, I'll leave you to it. Hold on, it's raining. Look, that thing... That thing you were talking about. I thought I'd already did this windmill though. Oh wait, that uh, that, that other challenge thing is here. Um, how did I even get up here? Ah, hell. Yeah, it's definitely up top. And I, apparently I get a paraglider at some point. I don't remember the other game having a paraglider. You know what makes this a lot less annoying? Is if the first time I did this, it like made like a shortcut or something back this way. But it didn't. So what's this? <laughs> Apparently not here. Search, search the chest on top of the viaduct. Well, hold on. I thought there was like another quest here. don't like pumpkins that much i mean i suppose if this is like the apocalypse and all i my choices are starve to death or eat pumpkins well i'm gonna eat the fuck out of some pumpkins <laughs> bitch
Oh no, it's like, it's, oh, I have to do this again. No, I did this before. I don't want to do it again. Are, are my ladders at least still there? Yes, yes they are. I thought there was another ladder I kicked over. Like over here. Is it still there? Yeah, it is. Yay! Bitch! <laughs> uh, it's just the greatest. It's the greatest thing in the whole game so far. Oh. Uh. This weapon? <laughs> that nut job has some splaining to do. Splaining. Alright, please don't kill me. Yeah. It's all your fault, it's all your fault. Get up there. this real quick we're out of here all right buddy I don't know how to thank you Will this do? Yeah, man, thanks. If you excuse me, I have some words with the with a monk. It's finally raining. All right, where's this fucking weapon? Before you say, what's a con job but a shiny stone to a simpleton? I'll knock it out of your... Whence comes such anger? Wait, whence? I climbed like an idiot to the top of the viaduct for nothing. Don't you see? You've gained the most powerful weapon after all. It's perseverance. <laughs> what? The most powerful weapon in the world is perseverance, which you displayed when you climbed to the very top. And I paid you for that? Give me my money back. Perseverance will overcome the greatest difficulties, and lack of it will destroy you, as it has destroyed our world. Win the war faster, research the virus faster and sloppier. So what will it be? Would you sacrifice your perseverance just to get your money back? 
Ah, whatever, dude. Well, when you put it that way, I, I guess I have learned something. What is each moment but an occasion to learn? Keep well. Ow. What's wrong? I think a bee stole me. Damn it. Zombie? Ah. I found your fake cards. Now let me see what you made me look like. Like the prince you are. Here's your Sparker card. Check it out. Come back here later. If you want to meet the people that liked your Sparker profile. <sighs> Alright. Good to see you. Um... What's left? Go to Liz's flat in search of Chloe. Okay. Oh, I don't know why I did that. God damn it! Ooh. Hey buddy! There's like quests, but it looks like they're like underground or something. See them right here? I, I have no idea how to get underground. I I'm assuming I can't because, you know, you see how there's this? I'm assuming I, I go underground at some point or, or another. Um, all right, whatever. It's like all of Villador is coming to see the Carnage Hall Carnage. Mister? Will that ever get old? I hope not. What the hell is it getting nighttime already? Yeah, so the this must be Europe. Um because they're calling her place a flat and in the states we don't use that term. We we call them uh, apartments. Oh my god. I just got here. Damn it. The infected made it inside. Oh. 
What's with the creepy singing? Chloe. What for? She's not here. Wash. Chloe's not here. She's not at home either. Aiden, she must be at Liz's. I don't know where else she could be. All right, I'll wait for her here. I hope you don't mind. I do. Chloe's gone. Like, gone, gone. Got it? Tell Wash to just forget about her. Chloe's left without him. Left? Or about to leave with you, I gather. Maybe. But why leave? There's water again. Yesterday they were fighting over water. Tomorrow it'll be another thing. Blood's always flowing here. We've had enough. We want to try somewhere else. We, that is, you and Chloe. So what about Wash? Wash? He was just our ticket out, that's all. Now he can fuck off. There was nothing I could do, Chloe. Wash? Chloe. Wait, so that's Chloe? I'm a grunt. No one told me what was gonna happen. Please, don't leave without me. Let me go with you, the three of us. Liz won't agree. So convince her. Aiden, come on, say something, please. You've been outside, you know how things are beyond the walls. You won't make it outside the city anyway. Two, three people, doesn't matter. You don't know what you're walking into. We could stay here, Chloe. You've got water now, right? So the fuck what? I want to leave. So how will you get past the PK? We'll think of something. And how will you survive without UV lamps? You're right. This whole plan was stupid from the start. So you're saying you'll stay? I'll stay. But I don't want to see you anymore. What? You were a means to an end wash. If we're staying, well, the end. But, Chloe, it wasn't supposed to go down this way. Sorry. Damn you, Aiden. Thanks for the advice. Uh. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't need to know, really. Boo. I'm gonna take your shit. All right, bye. Um, okay. Now what? I think the only things left are... There's this quest, right? But but the problem is it doesn't tell me where to go, right? So I don't know where these things are at. So as such, we're just going to leave that one alone. And we're just... I guess we'll just go to the story quest. Go to the water tower for explosives. I'm still not sure what that horn guy does. Like, I, I know it's not good. I just don't. Oh, that's cool. I've never seen this before.
time Sophie grew into the woman her mother was. Watch yourself, you hear? I blame you, zombie. Yeah. Bitch. This is one of those, uh, pretty sure I've already looted this one though. Yeah. I don't feel like messing with all that because then it just turns into like me just bashing the fuck out of everything for like ever. They've been searching us for weapons. Found our Molotovs and went ape shit, slaughtering everyone in sight. Looks like someone set us up. Who? And where are the bombs for Alberto? We managed to send some out. The couriers last reported near Star Square. Then silence. Alberto, the charges are gone. I'm going to the Star Square. That was their last check in. Exactly. Ada. Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. PK's ambushed your transport. He searched everyone and everything. Eventually, they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly, something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um, they were in the yard. Come on, maybe they didn't steal all of them. Lucky few of the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs> Oh my god. You're fucking up.
There's another big buddy over there. We'll deal with ombre over here. I'm just saying, thing things more fun than drop kicking enemies to pieces. I I don't know. I don't know if I want to know. Alberto, I have the charges. Wonderful, excellent. So what are you waiting for? Come back. Here I come. Alright, uh, was that all the enemies? I think so. Okay. Heading back. Yeah, I think the fun in this game is d directly proportional to how many skills that you have. Early in the game, it's not that fun. You're pretty weak. How was that, boys? You know, you like can't jump from very far. You know, everything fucking kills you. Ooh, that 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 would have been bad. Renegades? What are the re the renegades? Or I guess who are the renegades? Ah, oh, it's tempting. It's tempting. Every time I see that, I like want to give it a spin. Funny too, uh, I say the same thing about your mom. <laughs> you heard? People say the night runners are back. The night runners? What's a night runner?
Leave me alone! Who's man? Alright, I should probably repair my weapon. Probably would be a good thing for me to do. Who is the question? Naris, what's going on? It's Scott. He's gone missing again. I've been everywhere, asked everyone, but no one's seen him. What about Mo? Is he gone too? No, he's at home, safe and sound. What does he know about Scott's whereabouts? Nothing. And that worries me. They usually get into trouble together. If you want, I can look for your son. Oh, thank you, Aiden. You're a godsend. Right, tell me about Scott's disappearance. He left in the afternoon without Mo. And never came back. He was gone overnight. Even more strange. Some men came around that evening looking for him. And what did they want? Wouldn't say, so I chased him off. But later I saw Rude, Rude Weghorst, talking to him. I got a bad feeling. He's had it in for my boy lately. Maybe he has something to do with this. See, Scott's got a huge crush on Rude's daughter, and Rude's not having it. Started treating my boy like trash. Well, could Scott have run off with the girl? It's possible. He's completely head over heels for her. Lus should be at the bazaar. I was on my way back to look, but I ran into you. These men, any idea who they were? They said they were after someone without a biomarker. That couldn't be Scott, of course. They're not from the bazaar, that's for sure. And not the kind of people we like here. Right, I'll talk to Rude. You go home and keep an eye on Mo. To look after him better. Just find him. All right, let's fix up my thing. Fuck it, I'll go ahead and fix this too. I mean, that, that's a lot of cash I just blew through, but I mean. Whatever. Um, all right. Let's not just up upgrade the healing. Starting to see level uh, four stuff in the stores. Oh wait. Well, you know, you too, I guess. I trust them. Can you hear yourself at all? Rude. I need to talk to you. It's you, that pilgrim. You know, people said all sorts of things about you at first, but after what you did, tell me, how do you like it here at the bazaar? I'm slowly getting used to it. You can do a lot here as long as you keep the right company. And I know everyone here. Scott Gunter. Know him? Too well, unfortunately. I'm looking for him. For Naris. Did you know that he didn't come home last night? Well, if Naris had raised him properly, maybe he would have. Look, if you don't want to help him, then at least help me. Fine, I'll help you. What do you want to know? Some men came looking for Scott yesterday, and from what I hear, you talked to him. Yeah, they were recruiters or something. Recruiters? What do you mean? They were looking for able-bodied young men, so I referred them to Scott. How about your daughter? Would she know where Scott could be? Lust doesn't know anything. Did you ask her, or are you just saying that? My daughter has wasted enough time on that little shit. I want to talk to Lust. We owe you for the water, but damn it, I don't want you bothering my daughter. What if something has happened to Scott? 
No, out of the question. Go away before- You guys talking about Scotty? W what's wrong? Has something happened to him? He's gone missing. When did you last see him? Um, yesterday afternoon. Said he was going to prove himself? Prove himself? He can be a romantic. Romantic? I love you, Luss. But you gotta stop falling for that moron shit. So, what was this mission? Uh, I... I really don't know. Um, he just said that it would help us be together. Uh, you know where he was headed to prove himself? <sighs> Let's see. He did mention Crocodile Flats. It's a neighborhood west of Houndfield. Said he knew of some treasure there in an abandoned building. Please, you gotta find him. I'll do my best. Dad? Okay. What's this happening? is gonna be kind of weird you know for me to even say this, but this home. lady right here, she's for beautiful. For real. And good lord. I got a bad feeling about this. Something's not right, but I can't Man. help you. Um, anyway. Watch yourself, you hear? Alright, here. Where's your father? There you are. Only two? The PKs took the rest. Damn, damn it, triple damn. Because of that traitor, our plan is in danger. We must act quickly. No, nitrates. We need fertilizer. Then we can make more explosives. The old night runners, they've got everything. And certainly all we'll need to make more boats. I know a guy lives on a rooftop. Friend, foe, depends. Killian, you know him? My Hakon's friend, Killian? Yes, Killian. I'll explain how to... How to... Uh, uh, I know the way, thanks. You said that you know where Killian lives. Let me at him, let me at him. Should I? Eh, I was gonna say, should I drop kick a zombie? But I didn't encounter one. Something fucking stung me. Okay, sit down. The, the, the bee thing again? Wait, this is slightly different. One of us is prepared. Feel better then? My, what would you do without me? God, don't get too pleased with yourself. But thanks all the same. Okay, since I watched that, will it stop doing this? Because like I've, I've I've run across the bee thing like seven times now. Stand here. There's a zombie coming after me. I guess not. Oh, kitties. I love kitties. It's Aiden. Hmm. 
Hello. You there? Killian. Bro's not even home. I can't believe this lockpick hasn't broken yet. There's Hakon. Back there. Bingo. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs. They raided my plane. I can't talk. The freighter. It sold us all out. Hayden, Dad, went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Okay, I'll do my best. Just come quick. There's still after me. I'm pinned down, Hayden. Another patrol. You have to do it without me. Join my dad. I'll be on the radio the whole time. Me and your dad? You think that's a good idea? We have no choice, Hayden. Hurry. Okay, okay, calm down. You're stressing me out. This plan means everything to my dad. I don't know if you noticed, but dad's kind of awkward and unappreciated. This is a chance to show Carl, Sophie, everyone at the bazaar that they were wrong. What dad's made of, what he can do. He'll be the hero of the bazaar after this one. He always wanted to do something big. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Vincenzo, I... I can't hear you. What? What do I have to do? Ooh, an inhibitor container. Yeah, I want that. It, 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 it must be where the story mission is. I'll take it. You sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. <laughs> the windmill's causing too much interference. The radio doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out myself. It's as easy as I. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax! We'll do... Me and you will do... <laughs> no reason we won't do just... And Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. <sighs> what could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. No way. I, I want the container. Like I said, easy as pie. Shut up. Uh, okay, and let's do... I don't know. I like kind of like stamina more. Cause like, I mean, health is important, but I like stamina because it, it just makes it easier to do shit. Keep forgetting that happens. The bombs are ready. Sorry, I'm like upgrading myself here on the floor. Leave me alone. Hurry up, Aiden. We need to see the plan through to the end. Okay, you need to calm down.
Alright, here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Wow, that's some like M Mad Max level goofiness right here. So there's lots of ways I can get in here. I think I'll just go in through the bottom way here. I mean, look, here, here, here's Sitch. Oh, I've never, I haven't swam in this game yet. Ooh, I don't like it. This water's green. But here's Sitch. We all know how this is going to go. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to make it maybe five feet in here. I'm going to aggro someone and then I'm going to proceed to murder everyone. That's just how this is going to go. Because Kenzo is not known for like sneaking around and being stealthy. Kenzo is known for just brute forcing his way through any kind of like, you know, challenge. And that goes for both video games and real life. Planning, strategy. What I tell you? Oh, it's the back where I was. Um. Whatever. Got that bloodlust. We got a problem. Yep. Me. <laughs> Funny, man, my uh, my character is a menace. I can't I can't grapple up there. Not a problem. We got this, we got this. We don't got this. Ow. What's going on? Why won't he climb? What's going on? I, I like the um, architecture of this building. It, it, oh, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Booty Bay from World of Warcraft. Uh, I keep I I keep talking about World of Warcraft. I should just play the fucking game. Yeah, just give in. Just stream me playing World of Warcraft. You know, to an audience of nothing for like I don't know how, however long it takes me to to get tired of dealing with it. And I think as long as I just play the game and I don't like get in a guild and start talking to people and raiding and all that shit, it'll be fine. The instant I start going that other direction, well, that's when it starts becoming a problem. If you know, you know. I mean, I, I met some really cool people playing World of Warcraft, but then I also met some really fucking annoying people playing World of Warcraft. It's 
So, kind of a mixed bag as far as my experience. All right, hopefully I can just like zip line out of here. You know, there wasn't as many enemies as I thought there'd be. I thought this place would be crawling with enemies, but I only killed like what, four or five enemies? Oh, here we go. My final lockpick is finally gonna meet its maker. No way. Giving vibes like I need to grab onto that. Okay, is there a zip line to get down from here? Uh, I think there is a zip line to get down, but I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get to it. So instead of doing all that, we're just gonna take the easy way out. I wonder if I could jump on the water. Fuck it. Oh yeah, we're good. Oh yeah. And a Parker skill point. Um, what was I working on? Dart? Oh, enemy jump. Yeah, I want that. Press shift while running to gain a brief burst of speed. Oh, and you can jump further. That's cool. Hmm. Hello, get out of here. Ooh, those enemies over here? It is. It is. I thought that was a gun for a second. I was like, <gasps> I got all excited. I peed myself. Are, are, there has to be guns in the game because there's bullets that you find. I wonder if there's like a whole nother area that we go to at some point. All right, buddy. Uh -huh. Explosives are in place. Time for the fireworks. Would you like the honors? I know how much this means to you. That isn't triggering. Must be interference from the wind. Uh, it doesn't look like it did much. The windmill's still standing. Hey, look, the rotor's still spinning. Vincenzo's calculations. They must be off. It's fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. Um, hmm. it's 
my... What are you doing? An armed bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed... Um, uh, armed... Uh, we can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Hmm. It'll blow any second! Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back! A and? And plant it on... Uh, 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 place it on... Put it on... The Leave it by the base of the windmill? No! That will accomplish nothing! Right in the middle of the windmill? I can finish my own sentences! Thank you very much! On the rota! You have to climb up to the rota! To the very top? You serious? The bomb's ticking, Ada. You really think we have time for jokes? Oh my god. Well, this is a problem. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay. And I'm on fire. Is it possible just to ride this all the way to the top? Oh, no. There's not. Oh, shit! Alright. Here we go. Let's try going uh, this way. Oh, yeah. That's way faster. Okay. I think I know what to do. I think. I just have to do it. Come on, Kenzo. You can do this. I believe in you. No one else does. And no one else is even going to watch this video to get to this point to see you do this. But by God, I'm here with you. You're going to be the fucking hero that I need you to be right now. Dime. And uh, we'll just we'll try it again. Uh, I, I, I think I, I gotta ride the, the windmill somehow or another.
All right, I did it. Uh, oh, come on. Faster. Go on. All right, all right. I'm getting somewhere. Assuming I just go up there, huh? Alright, now we're getting somewhere. Let's not fall off the level. That would be tragic. Uh, I guess we're going up here. What have you done to him? That's what I mean. No, that's what I call a boom. <laughs> I got my boom. <laughs> you, you. You got them pretty good. Huh? And we, we got them good. Without you, the windmill would still be standing. Almost like the fireworks in 90... Uh, 90... Uh, even... Ah, oh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. <sighs> Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> Tell everyone we pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <coughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <coughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See? His, his old man's, huh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. <laughs> Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him. That... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise.
Damn, I was hoping the game would glitch and it would have uh, more stuff for me. Hey, Aiden, nice fireworks show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakon. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry! Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. Now we gotta run all the way back. At night. I kind of had that coming. I like got a little too big for my britches. So it was Carl who betrayed them. Oh, that a wrap. All cleaned up. Didn't put up much of a fight. Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. What about the prisoners? Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. I got a cramp. Anyone else see that? <laughs> <laughs> uh is there someone that's gonna be able to shit what they do to you jobs i'll kill all those motherfuckers anyway is there someone that's gonna be able to fix my armor and shit i don't know so. You shouldn't be messing with the PK. Uh, uh, uh. I'm a peacekeeper. Ready, asshole! <laughs> this dropkick is like overpowered, right? Because it's crazy, because you, you just. You just dropkick anything that gets in your way, and then you just fucking shit on it. It's that's great. You're free. I thought it was over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Fuck, Pilgrim. At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the Peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. But he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. Um, okay, I guess we're going up.
Hey. Aiden. Yeah, don't be scared. It's safe now. <sighs> Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! <laughs> Aiden's gonna pay me hella gold for you! Cut! Shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Guy wasn't even worth a golden shower. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, Whoa. coward! Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. Look, tell Aiden there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning. You're stupider than I thought. Come down and fight. And stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. Aiden, no! You got your affair in order. See you. You can't escape. Have a low cue from the start. <laughs> Aiden, we have reports that Aider's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without them. Aider withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. We're not getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wanted to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now... I run the bazaar, and I promise, we will defeat Ador, and I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! For Sophie! <laughs> they know how many PK creeps it takes to screw in a light bulb? None, because they're too dead to screw anything. <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a buzzkill, Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? We put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then... Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! To Alberto! So... Where's Vincenzo? He's outside. Look around. I thought one of these people had a machete on him. I mean, a machete, a, um, a gun hammer. Anyway, uh, I thought someone had a katana. That's, that's the word I'm trying to think of. Alright, whatever. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad, he really did it. Your father wanted me to tell you, um, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? Why are you telling me this? And not him. He died, Vincenzo. Died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles because of you. And because he was able to carry out your plan. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked ass, Vincenzo. Yeah, Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You, go in and check on Vincenzo. Now! You did a freaking awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. 
You're part of the Bazaar family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Hakon. Where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center. It's blocked. I have another idea. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay. I'm coming. <sighs> hmm. I was kind of hoping this, uh... This had reset. Okay, I, I just want to finish this one quest and then call this gameplay good. This gameplay's gone on a while, but... I, I mean, I'm, I'm, I don't, it, I'm having a blast playing this, so. Could have expected it. Oh man, this place is a distance. Like it's not that far, but it's not exactly close either. whiskey man I wouldn't mind a drink it is those goons sometimes those the regular kind of thuggy enemies that you encounter they remind me in of those basic enemies from um borderlands i don't know what they're called but you like know the basic goon enemies they're like oh i'll eat your bones or whatever the hell they say in that game it's a quest over here because of course there's a quest. Why wouldn't there be? Let's, let's go grab it real quick. Just see what it is. I don't necessarily have to do it right now. I don't care. I get my ration and I'm happy. Oh, since when are these guys out, out in the wall? See what this quest is. When we're on a break, nobody ever again. That sounds a bit extreme. Well, you think so? What do you think is the first step in loving yourself? I think it's forgiveness. Um, you seem to know the answer. Why don't you tell me? Flowers, flowers, precisely. Nowadays, I'm hanging around near the metro station in considerable safety and all. But before I joined the PKs. I used to live down in Trinity. I had a shop there, the Blooming Tulip, near the bazaar when it was still the Church of the Holy Trinity. I was raised in an orphanage among a multitude of apathetic people. <laughs> Maybe that's why I turned to flowers. But after the outbreak, people stopped buying them. Well, that's understandable. Certainly, but uh, there was this old lady I basically kept the store open just for her. She'd come every day, 
as if nothing had changed. Her visits were the highlight of my day, until one day she didn't show. What happened to her? Her flowers ate her alive. How should I know? I was growing these special pink roses for her. It was her last order, and I simply couldn't throw them all away. So I kept one of the roses and dried it, just for her. She'd be delighted to know that you never forgot her. Yeah. If only I could get that rose to her. Could you take it? She never said where she lived precisely, but I asked her once where she kept all her flowers. She said, in a beautiful house made of glass, where the old mound used to be. Here, take the rose. Please find the house and give it to her, if she's still there. Uh, sure. I would love to. Yeah, I like never do those other little side things. I mean, I probably should. I bet they give decent stuff. here let's go when yana heard you were coming she grabbed sarah and they left seems they weren't too fond of you hey, where are we uh... <laughs> ah, what? Fucking hell. Ah. calm down just let me see let me see ah, i'll help fuck. wait i'll help ah. show me relax you're gonna pull through what's that the wound from the Lazarus? You say you killed Lucas. If not for those brass knuckles, it would only took a few seconds to do the job. Ah, I thought he was a better fighter. Ah! The fuck are you saying? Ah, no point denying it with this wound, right? So you carved ah. out his tattoo and planted it on Barney. Ah, Waltz, he ordered the kill. You're working with Waltz and you didn't tell me? You piece of shit. Oh, you don't get it, kid. Waltz would have killed me, you see, like he killed Dylan. And anyone who defies him. I have to get out of here, get it? I couldn't have told you. Why? You know he's the one who tortured me in the past. I didn't tell you in order to protect you. So what if you find out something about your sister? Waltz will kill you. Where is he? Ah, fuck. Where is Waltz? I'm supposed to meet him under the electric car factory in the GRE tunnel. Hey, then I'm fucking dead here, understand? They're gonna kill me. You'd leave me. You'd leave me now. He did help me at the beginning I of the game. I shouldn't leave you to die for what you did. Why wouldn't you? I'm gonna find that sniper first. Ah. <sighs> really? You do that for me? A life for a life. After that, we're fucking done. Shut up. I'm done listening to your sage advice. I know, I fucked up. Let's leave it at that. Those bolts fly far and fast. Find something to hide behind. Tell me something I don't already know, Hakon. Okay. 
Watch out for all the chemical waste. I got eyes, Hakon. Aiden, you all right? Yep, I'm fine. Clever fucker. Oh god. Ugh. Shut the tank. I, I I thought I could uh run through it, but no, that's that's fine. That is off the table. get to the roof. I'm, I'm a little confused right now. Ah, is this gameplay ever going to end? It just keeps going and going. Drop the ladder. Well, so much for surprise. We figure something out. Still in one piece. <clears throat> for now, yes. I gotta get behind him somehow. Damn it. <sighs> this kind of reminds What the fuck? Come on. This kind of reminds me of that one area from the first game. Who else wants to kill you, Hakon? I'm so confused. Ader, the, uh, the PKs? I lost track ages ago. What the fuck? Alright, come on. Now, wh why didn't you do that a second ago? We don't know. Right, and then do this bullshit again. Hakon! Uh, who's this about the killing Lucas, sir? Tell Hakon that it's not wait. over yet. Hey, 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 wait, hey, hey, wait, 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 wait! Ah. Oh. Oh. Right in the mean beam machine. Um, okay. What was that one ability I was trying to get? It was like a charge move or something like that. Hakon, you still alive? Uh, my meter's still running. Hakon, yeah, she got away. But you're safe. For now. She? There was a woman? Fuck. Yeah, and I don't think she likes you. That sounded personal. Personal, huh? Doesn't usually narrow it down. 
but I know who it is. Watch out for her, Eden. She's one of the most dangerous people you'll ever meet. And yeah, noted. Now I'm going to the central loop. Beware of Waltz, Aiden. Renegades have appeared all over the center, and he's working with them. He's looking for the key you've got. I'm done listening to your advice. Sophie, I'm gonna need your help getting to the center. The guy who was supposed to get me there, he... Well, things got complicated. Aider's men are still fighting. They barricaded themselves inside the tunnel. I can't help you. What about our agreement? Relax. Listen, there's another way through. An old tunnel under the hills near the Tango Motel. It was used by smugglers. Peacekeepers didn't even know about it. It's been closed for years. But if you manage to start the generators, you might be able to get to the center. And <laughs> you're telling me this just now. Sorry, Aiden. I want to help you. But most of all, I have to help the bazaar. Good luck, Pilgrim. Those blue barrels always make me think of Half-Life 2 and all the various physics puzzles that involve using them. Alright, well, I guess uh, I'm done. Like, yeah, I'm done. There, there's been a lot that's happened in this uh, gameplay, so it's been a... It's, it's been quite the event. Um, I do... Not right now, but I think before I do anything else, I do want to go try to get that one windmill that I couldn't get uh, a while back. And then what's that over there? I mean, is that like um like the end game or like is that a ruin or what is that over there i don't know zombies everywhere zombies that's like one thing this this game does a really nice job of like it always makes the world feel so alive you know like everywhere i look well aside from right there but uh, most places i look i see zombies shambling around doing zombie things so it's pretty pretty cool I like it. So, uh, throw me a like. I am going to go and I will see you when I see you.